Hi everyone, my name's Aaron. I am the fifth generation main actor for Reillusion Character Creator 5. Just the thought of being turned into characters for movies, games, commercials, it's so exciting. I heard CC5 can change character shapes and sizes. If you change my handsome face into something ugly, I won't let you get away with it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I am so excited to see all the new things you guys come up with. Finally, 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 guys, the wait is over. And I'm excited, guys, to jump in and share with you some of the highlights that I've been noticing. One of the key, I think, features for me that is exciting is the support for MetaHuman Animation Data for Character Creator 5 models. This has been updated to a point where it's almost just seamless. You can swap out MetaHumans with Character Creator 5 models and vice versa. And there's so many cool things that they've added in here. Uh, please take a look at this page to see what's new. And I'm going to be doing more videos, just digging into the new features that have come out. Let me just give you a, like, a look at what the interface looks like. So this is Character Creator 5, and they've added some really cool new, let me press J to go back over here, uh, new models that are HD, they have better facial animation support, they have better detailing, they have better textures, and what is really cool is that even the CC3 Plus characters have been updated so they can support the facial animation uh, capabilities that have been added to Character Creator 5. And the key thing again is being able to take these characters into the Unreal Engine, adding meta-human facial animation, and then making them talk and perform and act out any part of your story. So to all my fellow creators out there, filmmakers, I think you're going to love Character Creator 5. I'm looking forward to creating short films with this. And what is neat is that these characters, you'll be able to use like the Transformer 2 up here with the CC3 Plus and be able to import DAS characters into Character Creator 5 and then take those characters into the Unreal Engine and use the MetaHuman animation data on them. That is what's really cool. And these are the starting blocks over here. They have a... Two new characters, there's Aaron and Ariana. So this is Aaron over here and Ariana is over here. And then the, remember the Camilla and Kevin, those have been updated as well so they can support uh, the facial animation capabilities of Character Creator 5. So, and then there's a clothed version of Aaron and a clothed version of Ariana. So if you don't have any characters to start with, these are the two characters you can start animating with so that you get a hang of what Character Creator 5 is all about. So there's so much that they've added in here, HD characters. Actor Mixer is an amazing, amazing option that enables you to be able to blend characters similar to what you see in the MetaHuman Creator plugin in the Unreal Engine 5.6. But what's really neat is that uh, you're able to create realistic characters as well as stylized characters. And that's what differentiates Garage Creator 5 to the Unreal Engine a meta human creator plugin. So this is really, really like detailed in terms of what you can do with these characters. You have way more control. So I I think that because of the meta human animator data support for character creator five models, I think you're probably gonna see more people using character creator five models in the Unreal Engine than ever before because of the the ability to customize these models to a more granular level compared to the meta humans. And maybe this will inspire uh, Epic Games to be able to update the meta human creator to have this level of detailing that we have over here. So I'm excited, guys. And by the way, Character Creator 5 has been updated, but so is Icron 8. 0.6. It has come out. So when you go over here to, you can see this. Uh, character creator 5 but there's also iClone 8.6 so make sure you update your iClone as well as all your plugins and then you, so that you can be able to send characters from character creator 5 to iClone 8.6 so guys that's what I wanted to share with you that uh, character <laughs> it's like a tongue twister character creator 5 is finally here and you are able, you will be able to buy it 
you can be able to do uh, test it like do, do a free trial and then if you love it there are some links in the description of this video go ahead and click that and uh, be able to purchase that so thank you so much for your support guys as always dare to dream big may we continue to use these uh, tools to tell our stories never ever give up on your dreams guys and what an amazing time to be alive i think real Vision team you've done an amazing job thank you so much guys for listening to us and i'm looking forward to seeing this get better and better and better because the foundation of character creator 5 is going to drive how we use meta humans and meta human animation data for storytelling so see you in the next video <laughs> bye for now and again if you haven't updated make sure you update your iclone to iclone 8.6 so that you are able to get support for the characters that are coming from character creator 5 so see you in the next video, guys. <laughs> Bye for now. Look out for new videos of what I'm going to share with you in terms of uh, like digging deeper into some of the, these uh, features, especially meta-human animation support.